guys and welcome back to Renee GTV. Today we're doing another Halloween recipe. Um, this is another pizza idea and it's going to be a jack-o'-lantern pizza. I have already uh, pre-baked my crust slightly and you can find that recipe on my channel if you need it. Now I'm just going to take some pizza sauce and we are going to place it on that crust. <clears throat> and yes, this is pre-made uh, pizza sauce. If you want to do homemade, you are more than welcome to do so. I am just going to spread that around and my pizza crust is a little warm because it did just come out of the oven. And I want to go all the way to the edge with this sauce. bring you guys right back hey guys so now I do want pepperoni on my pizza <clears throat> so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and layer the pepperoni right on top of the sauce it doesn't have to be any particular way at this point we will fix that once we add some cheese and some other goodies. So I'm just going to go all the way around and I'm going to layer it on. Now I've, I've added a pretty good layer of pepperoni to my pizza. Um, I'm going to go ahead and cover it with cheese because we don't really want to see that. And of course I'm using mozzarella. If you like this idea or want other fun, easy Halloween ideas, I definitely go check out my channel. I've got a snake pizza. It's a pizza roll um, shaped like a snake. Very cute and easy to do. And also we have a spider web pizza um, that has spiders and looks like a uh, web very cute and very easy as well so once you have that on I'm gonna go ahead and add some black olives around the perimeter of the pizza you can skip this step if you like you can add something different I'm going to go ahead and get those all placed on the pizza and then I'll bring you back. Okay. Guys, so I have my black olives uh, lining my pizza. Um, very easy to do. If you find that your black olives are not staying, you can just push in on the crust a bit with a spoon um, and that will hold them in place. Now I've just yeah. taken some pepperonis and we have cut them into triangles. We're going to have our little pumpkin eyes and our little pumpkin nose and then I have formed more triangles for our little pumpkin smile and I'm just placing those um, in a downward fashion just to give the idea of a grin. You can do this with red bell, red bell peppers um, or really any other type of pizza topping that you think would work. And there is our very cute, very simple pumpkin pizza. 
Um, kids are going to love this. I'm going to go ahead and place this in the oven until the cheese is nice and melty. And I'll bring you back and show you what it looks like. We'll be right back. Okay, guys, so here is our finished jack-o'-lantern pizza. Very simple and easy to do. The kids are going to love this. They can even decorate it. Uh, perfect for a Halloween party or get-together or even just dinner on Halloween night. Uh, thumbs up, guys, if you like it. Uh, don't forget to share me on Facebook and Twitter with all your friends and family. Appreciate all the great support. Uh, if you have any comments, leave them down below. I enjoy reading them and getting back with each and every one of you guys. And subscribe if you haven't. i got some great ideas coming up as well. So don't forget, guys. We'll see you next time. Thanks so much for watching.